the Olympic champion conducts master classes and receives special education. Will there be a replenishment in Tutbirds' headquarters soon? Alina Zajitova is actively trying herself as a coach, she goes to master classes, receives special education. The Olympic champion is getting ready to get over the side? Very likely. The figure skater has all the makings for this, and the example of Tutbirds before her eyes gives her inspiration. Shooting on the first and social life is not the only way for the famous figure skater. She is able to move figure skating forward and grow her own champions. Even before graduating from high school, Alina Zajitova was going to study at a sports university, she told me that she wanted to become a coach and, like a Terry Tutbirds, raise champions. The friendly girl got along well with the children, so it was not difficult to imagine her as a mentor. And her metal-rich past made her a desirable specialist at any ice rink. Who will refuse to train with an Olympic champion who has collected all the gold in two seasons? This incredible success would certainly set her apart from other specialists. Now I have taken a short break and am not competing. But I continue to train at the Crystal for 12 hours a day. In parallel, I participate in Tatyana Navka's show Sleeping Beauty, in which she entrusted me with the main role. And I am preparing to enter the Russian State University of Physical Culture. I want to train as a coach and, like a Terry Georgievna, to educate new champions, Zajitova shared with Tatler magazine in February 2020. However, the skater's plans changed somewhat after this interview. After passing the unified state exam, she applied to the Russian Academy of National Economy and Public Administration, RANIPA, where she eventually entered safely. And I decided to master one of the programs closest to show business there, production and cultural policy. Simultaneously with her studies, Alina began working as a TV presenter in the Ice Age and pleasing fans with her beauty from the TV screen. It seemed that the dream of becoming a coach had sunk into oblivion. But, shining on TV, the athlete did not forget about her native ice element and burning children's eyes. Her solid knowledge and invaluable experience required an exit, and soon Alina demonstrated her excellent coaching abilities. Last spring, Alina went to Yakusha to give a master class in figure skating. I set myself the most serious tasks. Not just to teach everyone some basic movements, but to work out with young figure skaters. The participants were selected, and those who owned double jumps got to Alina. The Olympic champion prepared the most effective exercises for the children and inspired them with her example. The children were delighted with Alina, and she got great pleasure from working with them. It is not surprising that after that she again found herself in the role of an applicant. This time Alina decided to get a second higher education at the Russian State University of Physical Culture, Sports, Youth and tourism. She entered the pedagogical faculty, so in the future she will receive an official coaching crust. And this is very important for full-fledged work with children. Combining studies at two universities, of course, is very difficult, but the champion character allows the girl to push the boundaries of what is possible and achieve any goals. Alina knows what she wants and is always ready to work hard. In the Olympic season, Alina Zajitova went even further in her master classes. Literally. For the sake of young athletes, she went to distant Mexico in November. No filming in the Ice Age stopped her. She devoted her only free week to classes with children on another continent. I went through a very difficult time zone change, but I was happy to share my experience. And to sweeten the intensive classes for my students, I brought them a chocolate surprise from Russia. Is it possible not to love such a coach? In Mexico, Alina was expected to attract attention, so she answered a lot of questions there. Including the desire to become a coach. I decided for myself that I will not make any plans for the future. We don't know where life will lead us. I like both journalism and television. And, of course, to be a coach. I think it is very worthy to pass on experience to the younger generation and it is important for me," Zajitova admitted. Such reasonableness is very impressive. Alina is very young, but already thinks about the connection of generations and cares about the future of her sport. On a global scale, wants figure skating to develop all over the world. Alina confirmed her coaching gift at the next master class in Khabarovsk. 
The trip to the young figure skaters together with Daniel Glichengos and Sergi Dudikov turned out to be incredibly successful. Alina worked tirelessly for long hours and even taught one of the participants how to flip correctly. But once Alina inspired this girl with her performance at the Olympic Games to go figure skating. The baby was only three years old at the time, but that day remained in her memory. It was my dream to see Alina. I watched the Olympic Games where she performed when I was still three years old. At that time, she started figure skating. I hope to become an Olympic champion too. I like everything about Alina Zajatova's skating jumping, spinning. She helped me a lot. She showed me how to jump flip correctly, I finally got it. It turned out that I used to put my foot under me, but I need to go back, seven-year-old Arena Murashko happily told Kabarov's cry today. In gratitude for the help, Arena hugged the Olympic champion very warmly. And after training, Zajatova was showered with flowers by the rest of the athletes. They didn't want to let her go, everyone liked working with her so much. A wonderful coach should come out of Zajatova. The Terry Tutbirds can be proud that her famous pupil continues to contribute to figure skating. At first, Alina moved him by riding in competitions, and now she helps others to reach heights in this beautiful sport. Excellent personnel reserved for the Tutbirds team for the future. Perhaps it is in her native crystal that Alina will later find a job and raise her champions. Former students in Tutbirds's coaching staff are always welcomed. Polina Tserskaya, for example, leads a junior group there for the second year, although she originally planned to become an economist. Well, it's not necessary for Alina to sacrifice her career on television for coaching. Maxim Trankov clearly showed her that you can succeed in both fields, although you still have to give a leading role to something. But nothing prevents Alina from changing her priorities over time, she will be able to take any road.